to try each side of the street. Yeah. What it means to us as a team is that we're making people's homes safe and healthy. You know, everyone deserves to have a safe, healthy home. So our program is looking to find those homes that have the chance of lead-based paint and have children under six present so that we can go in there, test the home for lead, and remove any lead hazards that we find. Perhaps some have um, had the program in the past, the few that we've had talked to, very receptive. A lot of people are opening the doors, being very nice. They can't see it, they can't smell it. They don't really have an idea that it could be harmful. So that's why we're here is to educate them. If you're in an older neighborhood where there are a lot of homes that are not repaired already or fixed up, and you have children under six living in the home, visiting the home, or a pregnant woman, that is our target. Lead-based paint was uh, outlawed, for a better word, uh, for residential use in 1978. So it's not always in the paint, it could be in the water, it could be disturbed in the water, it could be disturbed on cooler vents. Lead-based paint, you know, affects children under six mostly. It gives them headaches, it gives them hearing loss, attention deficit. Sometimes they can, children can, you know, get very, very sick. I am from South Phoenix. I lived here in South Phoenix. I, I've lived in, in Phoenix all my life. So to reach out to, to where I was you know, raised, it, it makes me feel that I'm giving back to my community. We do community events, we speak at schools, we speak at medical uh, providers. We just want to get the word out so as many people know as possible. One life better lived. That's why we're out here.